Good morning students. Let's start today's assignment and the topic given to us is people as resources. So here we go with question number one that state the two types of unemployment existing in rural India and the answer is number one seasonal unemployment when people are not able to find jobs during some months of the year is known as seasonal unemployment and the second is disguised unemployment. So when the contribution made by the extra family members in one plot of land which is not productive means disguised unemployment. And moving on to question number two, what is meant by seasonal unemployment? Seasonal unemployment happens when people are not able to find jobs during some months of the year. Moving on to question number three. A work requires the service of five people but engages eight people. Which type of unemployment is this? So when only five people is required in a work and eight people are engaged, it is known as disguised unemployment. As the field requires the service of five people and three extra people are the disguised unemployment. Moving on to question number four, how many unemployment problem differs in rural areas? So if we say in case of rural areas, it has been seen that is seasonal and disguised unemployment, whereas urban areas have educated unemployment. So moving on to question number five, mentioned two consequences of unemployment. The first, it leads to wastage of manpower resources and number two, it trends to increase in economic overload. Moving on to question number six, unemployment rate is low in India. Why? The answer is in India, the unemployment rate is low because a large number of people with low income and productive are counted as the employed. move on with question number seven what is an indicator of a depressed economy in the country an indicator of a depressed economy in the country is increasing unemployment moving on to question number eight in which sector disguised unemployment is mostly found disguised unemployment is mostly found in the agricultural field moving on to number nine that is a uh, fill in the blanks in urban area youths with graduation and post graduation degrees are not able to find job this type of un unemployment is called dash so the answer is in urban areas youths with graduation and post graduation degrees are not able to find job this type of unemployment is called educated unemployment Moving on to the next question, that is question number 10. Employment structure is characterized by self-employment in the primary sector. Explain it. So the answer is, the whole family contributes in the field even though not everybody is really needed. So there is disguised unemployment in the agricultural sector. All the family also have a share in what has been produced. The concept of sharing of work in the field and the produce raised reduces the hardship of the unemployment in the rural areas. But this does not reduce the poverty of the family. So, so today all together we have 10 questions. That's it for today. Have a good day. Thank you so much.